Hello, if you are working in 3ds Max Studio, this should be interesting. Let's see how much difference in performance $1500 can do. On the left I have HP Victus with AMD processor and on the right I have the latest Asus Zephyrus with the latest i9 processor. I will do some viewport walkarounds and renderings using GPU and CPU. Let's get started. I will start with Asus. I will put everything on turbo mode. Now you will hear the fans. It's quite loud when it's starting to use the fan at maximum speed. For the model, I will use a cat. The renders will be done using V-Ray 6. The model is quite heavy because the cat has a lot of fur. You will see. Now the model is open. In the perspective view, Everything is as smooth as you would expect from this uh, laptop. If we open the viewport with V-Ray, now you will see everything will be a little bit jittery, but still workable. If, however, I open the fur, then that's it. It will be much, much slower everything. But normally you are not working with fur activated. Now, if I want to work with the fur, I will disable V-Ray in viewport. And the model is easy, absolutely easy workable. Now, I am on HP Victus and I will put everything on performance mode and I will max out the fan speed. We'll open the same cat model. The model is open absolutely no problem manipulating the model. If I will open VRA viewport, I will wait a bit. Again, workable. Not a big difference from the other level. If I will, however, activate the fur in viewport, now this is resource consuming. So let's see if I can manipulate in live view. It's difficult but still works. In any case, if I want to work with the fur, I will deactivate the rain viewport. And now I should be able to rotate the model easily as you can see. So not a very big difference in terms of performance if you are working in viewport. Because the viewport mainly is using not the GPU but the CPU and the CPU in this laptop from AMD it's very very powerful so i9 from Intel it's not far away even if it's much more expensive and this is only Ryzen 7 not Ryzen 9 now let's compare the render times between two laptops I will be using V-Ray 6 these are the settings I will leave them on default same as on the other laptop will render only one frame. So, let's render. This laptop, as you will see, has a tendency to become very, very hot. Okay, the render is done, it took around 2 minutes, 1 minute and 59 seconds to finish this render and the laptop was running very hot, 96 degrees during this render. Now I will render the same file, the same frame, but on HP Victus. Here are the settings, the same as on the other laptop. Let's render. Okay. okay, the render is done, it took 2 minutes and 34 seconds. 
Now I will render the same frame, the same file, but with GPU. Let's select the settings, save everything as we had on the other laptop. Okay, the render is done. It took 6 minutes and 19 seconds. Now I will render the same file, the same frame on HP but with GPU. Let's select VRA GPU 6. These are the settings. Let's start. Okay, the render is done, these are the passes and it took 7 minutes and 5 seconds. In conclusion, Asus with the i9 it's 25% faster than the Ryzen in HP. And if you are rendering using GPU, the Asus with 3070Ti will be 12% only 12% faster than RTX 360 from HP. Okay guys, hope this was helpful. See you, bye!